big red dog. Clifford needed Emily, so she chose him for her own. And her love made Clifford grow so big that the Howards had to leave their home. Clifford's the best friend anyone could know. He's the greatest dog ever. I really think so. Clifford's so loyal. Clifford. He's there when you call. I love Clifford, the big red dog. So they packed up a family car and the Howards left the city. They moved to Birdwell Island and their many new friends. There to greet Clifford and Emily. Clifford's so much fun, he's a friend to us all. I love Clifford, the big red dog. <laughs> Ooh. is me. That's you in the picture? Uh-huh. My name's Frankie. My human owns this new shoe store. It's nice to meet you, Frankie. I'm Cleo, and this is Tebow. Wow, you look so small. I am small. It's the picture that got big. It's impossible for a dog to be that big. Of course, I could be wrong. Hey, do you guys know who the enormous dog in this picture is? <laughs> uh huh. Do you know where he is? <laughs> uh huh. He's right here. Ruff, ruff, ruff. <laughs> Clifford, meet Frankie. Frankie, meet Clifford. Wow, you're big. Wow, you're small. You're really big. And you're really small. Now that we've got that settled, want to play hide-and-seek with us? Sounds like fun. Let's play at the park. Great. Hop on. <laughs> Whoa! seen things from this high up before. Clifford, you're the luckiest dog in the world. Okay, guys. Since I'm the best finder, I'm gonna count to ten while you guys go hide. Okay. okay. One, two, three, four. Find me so fast, Cleo. It's a gift. Nazi. 
<laughs> this sure was a yummy place to hide. I can't believe you haven't found Frankie yet, Cleo. Yeah, this is the longest it's taken you to find anyone. Hey, this is his first time playing with me. I don't want to find him too fast or I might scare him away with my brilliance. <laughs> hey, where is he? I found him, Cleo. A dog your size can do everything, Clifford. You're good at hiding. Thanks, but Clifford sure is good at seeking. <laughs> Please, I could have found you. I was just, um, a, a weak from thirst. Let's go get some water. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. But that wouldn't happen to me if I were big like you, Clifford. I hope Frankie can play with us again today. I want to play tag this morning. Let's see if he's here. What took you so long? Didn't you hear us? I didn't hear you guys. But I sure heard Clifford. Uh, did you grow last night, Frankie? You noticed, huh? I'm much bigger than I was yesterday, thanks to my big shoes. Those are great, Frankie, but why do you want to be bigger? I want to be like you. You can run so fast and reach so high. You want to be like me? Come on, let's go play some tag. I should be able to run really fast now that my legs are longer. Maybe my big shoes weren't such a great idea after all. I just wish there was some way I could be bigger. I think I might know a way. What is it, T-Bone? Well, Sheriff Lewis just bought me this new dog food. And the commercial says it helps us grow big and strong. There's a whole bag of it in my garage. I know that dog food. The commercial says it helps build dogs' bodies 15 ways. That sounds perfect. Can I try some, T-Bone? Sure. Well, come on then. Let's go help Frankie grow big and strong. Can you see the dog food, T-Bone? It's right over there in the corner. T-Bone, are you sure it's okay if we take some? Well, Sheriff Lewis wants me to grow strong. I'm sure he wants Frankie to grow too. So, what are we waiting for? Let's go get some. Oh, I can't get in. And I can't lift it! Uh, whoa! Uh. I'm sorry, Frankie. I guess we can't get in. I think I could get in. Yeah? Why don't you try? He did it! Oh, yeah. wow! Wow, 
Wow, he's eaten almost the whole bag. If he does this every day, he'll be bigger in no time at all. Here he comes. Excuse me. Wow, he is bigger. <laughs> Do you feel any bigger, Frankie? Yeah, I feel bigger. In my tummy. But I don't think that's gonna make me run any faster or reach any higher. I'm so full. I can hardly move. I guess I'm never gonna be like you, Clifford. Why do you want to be like me, Frankie? Because you can do everything better than I can. No, I can't. You can run faster than I can. But you can hide better than I can. You can drink from your water dish. But you can swim in it. And you could go through T-Bone's window when none of the rest of us could. And you can fit into a shoe. Yeah, maybe you're not as big as I am, but I think you're just the right size for you. Yeah, I guess I am just the right size for me. So come on, let's go to the library and play tag. No thanks. Why not? I'm a little too big for that right now. <laughs> <laughs> Clifford! It's story time! You want to hear a speckle story, don't you? Woof, woof. <laughs> I thought so. He's your favorite. Today's story is Speckle and the Hiding Place. One sunny afternoon, Speckle and his friends were playing hide and seek, and it was Reba's turn to be it. While Reba counted to 10, Luna, Ravi, Darnell, and Speckle scattered off to hide. Once she finished counting, it was time to find everyone. First, she found Darnell, cleverly hiding behind a fun-shaped bush. Then she found Ravi and Luna, hidden in a flower patch. But where was Speckle? Reba looked and looked, but she couldn't find him. Then Reba heard Speckle calling to her. Looking up, she saw that he was in the tree where he'd been the whole time. Laughing with her friends, Reba declared that Speckle had found the best hiding place of all. The end. That was a great story. Isn't reading fun? <laughs> Me tea. You're welcome. Freeze again! I am the queen of freeze tag. Oh yeah, uh-huh, I'm good. Uh, can we unfreeze now, Cleo? Oh yeah, unfreeze. It took you a while to get us that time, Cleo. Oh, I could have won a long time ago. I was just taking it easy on you. I don't know. T-Bone and I make a pretty good team. <laughs> we do now. But I remember when we first started playing together. What happened? When I first moved here, T-Bone was a little afraid of me because I was so big. Then I got to know him and I found out what a nice guy he is. So where's the problem? Well, we knew we wanted to be friends and play together, 
but we weren't sure how. I remember one morning, Clifford came over to play with me. <sighs> ah, what a beautiful day. Hey, where'd the sun go? Whoa! Whoa, whoa! Hello there. Are you here to play with T-Bone? Go on, you two. Have fun. Want to go smell the cookies baking at the bakery? Or we could go to the beach and dig some holes. T-Bone? Sorry about that. I'll slow down a little. Oh, thanks. That'd be great. So you want to go to the park and play some fetch? That sounds like fun. And I know a shortcut. Play hide and seek instead? Uh uh. Let's play fetch. Great. Let's go. Whoa. Uh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> we need to find just the right stick for a game of fetch. Right. Found one! Great! What do you think? Wow! It's big! Throw it! Throw it far! I love it when it goes far! Okay! Uh, I think that's a little too far! <laughs> yeah! Hey! How about I throw one for you? Okay. Want me to throw it again? Okay. <laughs> Want me to throw it again? Uh, no, that's okay. You want to go play in the water? Okay. Last one in is a Krabby Krab! <laughs> I love playing in the ocean! <laughs> That's great! Come on out, T-Bone! Uh, okay. S sorry, Clifford. This is as far as I can go. Gosh, this isn't very deep, is it? It is for me. I see what you mean. W wanna do something else? Well, it's getting kind of late. I have to go pick up Emily Elizabeth from school. But maybe we can play again tomorrow. Sure. Okay, see ya, T-Bone. See ya! Hey! 
careful, T-Bone. I've just been groomed. Sorry, Mac. I saw you with that new dog, Clifford. Isn't he a little big? Aha! Uh -huh. And he's really nice. How can you guys play together? It is kind of hard. But we'll work it out. But you're so, so different. I know. But that's part of the fun. Oh, <sighs> whatever. I've got to go, T-Bone. I've got a dog show tomorrow. I'm going for best tail in show. Max's right. Clifford and I are different. So maybe we just need to find a different way to play. Oops. Sorry about that, T-Bone. I didn't see you. That's okay. <laughs> Do you still want to play today? Sure. Do you? Uh -huh. But maybe we can think of some different ways to play together. Great. Let's go. Want to play fetch again? Well, it didn't work out so well yesterday. Maybe we could play it differently. Okay. Go ahead and throw it. And throw it far. I love it when it goes far. Right. Let's, Let's go, go fetch. fetch. Get it, T-Bone. We did it. We played fetch. <laughs> that was fun. Let's do it again. We could. Or we could go play in the ocean now. Okay, but we don't have to be so far apart today, do we? Uh-uh, I have an idea. Ha-ha! <laughs> this is great! I'm Captain T-Bone of the USS Clifford. Where to, Captain T-Bone? Let's take a trip around Birdwell Island, home of the famous Big Red Dog. <laughs> we had so much fun that day. Uh-huh. It took some experimenting, but we finally found some great ways to play together. What a good story. It'd make a great book. Well, hello, everyone. I'm glad you're all here. I found something in the garage that I think you're going to like. Here you go. I'm sure the three of you will find a way to have some fun with this together. <laughs> All aboard the Birdwell Island Express! I think we're doing something wrong here. Maybe we should try working together. Good idea, Clifford. It's worth a try. Okay, then. Let's do it. Yes! Yes! yes. Work 
working together as a team makes playing more fun for everyone. That's why Clifford's big idea for today is work together. <laughs> Human owns his new shoe store. It's nice to meet you, Frankie. I'm Cleo, and this is Tebow. Wow, you look so small. I am small. It's the picture that got big. It's impossible for a dog to be that big. Woof, woof. Of course, I could be wrong. Hey. Do you guys know who the enormous dog in this picture is? <laughs> uh-huh. Do you know where he is? <laughs> uh-huh. He's right here. Ruff, ruff, ruff. <laughs> Clifford meet Frankie. Frankie meet Clifford. Wow. You're big. Wow. You're small. You're really big. And you're really small. Now that we've got that settled, want to play hide and seek with us? Sounds like fun. Let's play at the park. Great. Hop on. <laughs> Whoa! I've never seen things from this high up before. Clifford, you're the luckiest dog in the world. Okay, guys, since I'm the best finder, I'm gonna count to ten while you guys go hide. Okay. okay. One, two, three, four.
Red Ted, Red Ted, Red here I come! Hooray for me! It's Clifford, I see! How did you find me so fast, Cleo? It's a gift. Yet, Cleo? Yeah, this is the longest it's taken you to find anyone. Hey, this is his first time playing with me. I don't want to find him too fast or I might scare him away with my brilliance. <laughs> hey, where is he? I found him, Cleo. A dog your size can do everything, Clifford. You're good at hiding. Thanks, but Clifford sure is good at seeking. <laughs> Please, I could have found you. I was just, um, a, a weak from thirst. Let's go get some water. Okay? Yeah, I'm okay. But that wouldn't happen to me if I were big like you, Clifford. I hope Frankie can play with us again today. I want to play tag this morning. Let's see if he's here. What took you so long? Didn't you hear us? I didn't hear you guys. But I sure heard Clifford. Uh, did you grow last night, Frankie? You noticed, huh? <laughs> 